more I learn about this game and the community around it, the more I realize it's staring back at me and telling me. There you are, so you spend your money and time wisely here. And then I forget I'm making a YouTube video, so uh, let's get on with it. You know, uh, the other thing I also forget is that it's a video game, and then the only reason this thing even exists is because it makes more profits than what it costs to continue to develop the game, so if people don't buy the content provided the game, does it just poof, go away, go offline? Does it just, just, do they just turn the game off? I say that me do your content the trash, please. This is not a channel regulated for doing your content, thank you. But it's something that I've grown so attached to that it feels more than just a a video game. All my warm done feelings aside, this profit earning executable file actually has a big spot in my heart. Okay, 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 we get it. Congrats on having feelings for a thing you like. What are you gonna nitpick now? Not enough clothes uh, for your little dress up game? Hmm? Hmm? No, it's, just, it's a little hard to put my finger on it. There's just there's so much potential in this game still to do a lot of neat things. Hey, Sega. You. Are you paying attention? Hey! Hello? Hello? Alright, clearly, so I'm not gonna get their attention yet. You know, I could go on and on about my ideas on how to improve the game, make it a better experience, but you're just gonna have to trust me on this one. I got some fucking ideas as Tiger would love to hear. I got some beautiful ideas about a gameplay that would just fucking eat up. But you know, they don't even know that I exist right now, it's, it's fine. You know, the last thing I want to do is mess with anyone's expectations and contributing that much more of a possibly negative experience just because of my wishful thinking. We need to go with us, Rico. What we, we could do? What can we do? I don't know what to do. I'm so hot. Then I go. Uh. Props to get imitators for trying to keep things positive as usual. But th there's this itch. It's it's deep inside of my pants. Like it's it's really hard to ignore what we had then versus what we have now. You know, Zuriko, I think I've got a little remedy. For your problem when you're feeling down and out of place the whole world feels like a rat race. fuck no man what are you doing oh no it was not as funny as i thought it was gonna be in my head so you probably want something more specific right i mean i can tell you right now once we get more combat photon arts new weapons skills interesting things to fight and an improvement of basic features with you know more cosmetics. That'll probably be enough. These are things that they can do and they've done it before. It's just a matter of patience and if we can just all work together as a community. Okay, well, all right. All right. Okay, I know. I had, that answer sucks. The thing about New Genesis is, you know, it doesn't have to be an open world like Breath of the Wild or have an incredible combat system like Nier Automata or even be the world's best fashion simulator character customization anime second life thing. It needs to be PSO2, New Genesis. And actually, that's what it's doing right now. You know, these things don't happen overnight. They're gonna have to put it out with updates and that takes time because game development is hell. They're working on the game right now, believe it or not. You don't have to believe me. I'm just telling you that they're they're doing it. These are facts you can look up for yourselves, people. The aliens are real. And the more we reach out and, and, and communicate with each other and do all that lovey-dovey stupid shit as a community as we should do to try and improve our game. And, and let's hope Sega is paying those developers to make a better experience, but that goes without saying. Even though I said it. And sure, we don't get to see everything that goes behind the scenes, but I think in our case, right now, it's best to just see what happens next. The Retem update didn't save the game, but it, it just, it you know, it gave us hope. Don't get me wrong, I am smoking some sweet ass copium right now. It, it's good shit, but we're still gonna have to get through the lows and highs together. And if the game does get better, then we'll all win anyways. Uh, and if it doesn't, then I'll just go touch some fucking grass or something, I don't know. Well, what I can say now in the beginning of 2022 is that the future looks bright for our game. We still got our Fantasy Star Nintendo Directs happening every month that I look forward to. Godspeed, hero, you cute little bastard. Every time I see his face on screen, I get excited all over again. I hope he knows how much we appreciate him for delivering the good and, you know, the bad news. It takes a dude with big balls to potentially make your face a target for nigga. <laughs> <laughs> Try it again. Takes a dude with big balls. Takes a dude with big balls. Takes a dude with. <laughs> takes a dude with big balls. <laughs> Heroes got some motherfucking giant titty nuts. <laughs> All right, I'm gonna. Takes a dude with big balls, to potentially make your face. What was? 
I didn't even fucking read it. I I don't even know what I was getting. I lost the point. The, the point is, is that I'm glad we get a nice fancy presentation of brand new fancy star news every month. It's, yeah, thank you. If anything you can think of it like a journey, we all get to go together on. It's one of the things that brings us character action fashion weaves together. So, Zuriku, what, uh, what we do now that uh, you said everything ever needed to be said by someone and nobody ever has to make a video about Fantasy Star New Genesis ever again? Well, I guess you'll just have to stick around and find out. Oh, you thought something funny was going to happen right here? No, I, I couldn't think of anything. Just the like and subscribe button. It's going to help me stay motivated to keep making videos. Next time, I'm not going to record 3 o'clock. In the morning when, you know, I have to whisper and yell at the same time. Not happy with it, but it got it done.